Hey, hey everyone and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy Part 16. We need to meet Puppy near the Iron Day Cave and we happen to be right in front of it, so that's not bad. There's no telling what lies in wait for me in there. Oh. Alright, we need to go in, but first we need to wait for her. It's probably a you good made start. It. Oh yes we did. Oh, it actually looks nicer when now when it's um now when it's um sunlight. Maybe just before we do that? Let's just, I just noticed there was this balloon in the background. Let's see if it's all here. Mm. Okay, so it looks like we got all five there. Now let's just take them. Or we could take them on the way back since we need to go back anyways. I haven't seen the mill either. Like I saw it before from a distance, but... Oh, or maybe I have since I have the flu flame here. That could be. Maybe I just forgot. This is quite a nice place. Just look at the graphics here. Pretty cool, I'd say. All right, let's dive into these. We should just pop by. I'm wondering how far we are with that, actually. All right, just three out of fifteen. So still a long way to go. It's rather dark in there. All right, it talk to you, Poppy. Sweetie. I take it this means you had some luck at the Look library. at the bees behind it us. It took a few hours and some eye-watering maps, but I think this might be the cave Doran told us about. Impressive. Especially with how little information he gave us. Well, I'm still not sure this is the cave, but it did seem the most promising. I stumbled across some folklore about a cave in the area that people avoid. Seemed the perfect place to hide something of value. It's a bit of a leap, I confess, but might a mysterious item such as a special moonstone be hidden in an equally mysterious cave? I think I'm desperate for anything at this point. Alright, well, let's poke around this mystery cave. Well, we're here. We might as well have a look. Agreed. After you. I wonder if you go blind from staring directly at Okay, so quest started. The centaur and the stone? Moonstone Garden. Okay, so this is a new place. Haven't been here before. Like, if it's equal to a normal somewhat cave... Those are quite large, so if there is an entire quest wrapped around this one, this one might be uh, pretty large as well. Okay, let's see what's in here. Revelio. Okay, so we already got some you stuff don't to think solve. The rumors about the cave are true, do you? I suppose we'll find out, won't we? Hmm. Okay, this is just a chamber. And that's it, pretty much. Yep, it is. And then we can pull this one. Of course there's spiders in there, we can see that. Rebellion. It's a bit revealing, but yeah. Don't know if we can do anything about... Oh, we probably can't, uh... Probably can't kill them. Unidentified hand item, not bad. I think this is it for here, at least. Right? Yeah, it is. So let's blast this one open. Find the moonstone. A few coins. Oh snap. Oh, I can't attack it while I Imperia do it. it. Now we just need to wait for it to sort of fade off. Oh, she threw one of those cabbages. Didn't we disturb it though? Like we entered this cave and it was here. It was just chilling in peace until we come in. Okay, so there must be something here. Oh yeah. Look at these. I didn't know that they were actually objects. I thought they were just no collide, but okay, we can push them. What was that? Not rag not rash break. Okay. Hmm. This these sounds sounds like there's something about to happen. Can I bombard that one? Bombarda. Oh yes. Hmm. And something here. Incendio. Alright, we need to um 
We need to Lumos that thing. We we'll probably need it on our... Oh, she also cast it. So every time I'm casting stuff, she's probably gonna mimic that. If it's like Lumos or the Concilio or whatever it's called. What's it called actually? This one. Ah, this illusionment, right? Our stealth, basically. That was it, I guess. Or maybe we need more. Let's so open this one. Should there be something here? Since we have to do it like that. This one also has like an icon on it. But I just don't Rebellion. see much we can do, really. Other than take those didn't leaves. But something is up there, though. How do we get up there? I want to go up. Oh, right. We need to push it, of course. Is this enough? That can't be enough. More. Is it going down again? It is going down. Okay, wait. Here we go. Yes, this is better. Nice. Yeah, we don't want to miss this. So look at that unidentified outfit item. I guess that's all now. Okay, now we can proceed. Alright, let's see what's in here. Probably more spiders, I imagine. Or not? What is that? What are those? Foibers. It's Fruvers. I beg your pardon? This must be how the rumor about the cave started. The Fwoopers song is said to drive anyone who hears it mad. <laughs> okay, so let's not listen to its song. Wondering if it's... Is it because it's that bad? Or is it... Uh, is there some... Or is it just like... Uh, oh, I don't know. Okay, but we need to get to those Fwoopers then. We can do that. Just need to make sure we got most stuff here. There's also a bunch of chests here. And what's... like something is below here as well. Not sure how we're gonna get that. If the moonstone is here and so are Fwoopers, I wonder if it's being protected. Revelio. Because I see a chest there. I'm wondering if we can get to that later. Because I don't think we can get to it just now. We can get this, of course, but that's probably it for now. Okay. Let's just continue. Oh, wait. Each has an icon over it. Okay, so if we need to open this one, we gotta use the triangle and the circle. So... That's this one, triangle, and then the circle. Open, yes. Nice. Large rare rugs, okay. And for this one, we need triangle and different circle. Why am I not surprised? First, the Fuipas in the Oh, yes. Ah, that's one of these, okay. Rebellion. And then we need, like... Just a uh, circle and square. So this one and this one. Tetris block. We need to find mods for those spinners. And that was all, right? That was all the doors, at least. Yeah. So let's take this moth. Lumos. Lumos. Thank you, Bobby, for also casting it. But it's okay, we just need one right now. And time to push it. Oh wait, that's just half of it. Oh, we need another one. Okay. Hmm. Oh, that's just over here. Okay. That was pretty simple. Here we go. And then also push this one. Nice. Another obstacle. Oh wait, we need no another one. I'm sure we can work out a way across. Probably. Rebellion. Hmm. So we got one here. And there is 
It's down there. Oh wait, we need to uh, we need to head in here as well. Can I just jump down and dive? Let's see what's in here. Ah, maybe that was one of those hidden parts we couldn't find before. Or where we could see that something was below. We're this ready. might be it. Fringe breaststone scarf. Okay. See some enemies here. Oh snap. <laughs> Didn't want to do that. I don't think if I I don't think I can dodge in this water. Oh, maybe they can't strike me? Ouch. Bombarder. Gotta watch out, I don't want to fall down into the water again. Or maybe I should just stay up here. That works. And that might... Oh wait, there's still so much more actually. Where do we start? Probably here. And some duck buck stuff. Tongue, right. How many tongues do we have in this bag now? We've uh, killed so many now. Ooh, large chest. Nice. That was the one that looked uh, just all uh, like it was tilted down. Oh, wait, now we're back to somewhat where we started, I think. Hmm. Okay, that's a bit confusing. Oh, wait, that's the way back. That's the way back because we can't just dive. Oh, maybe we can dive back, like, below the water. But this is actually an exit. But before we exit, I think there was a little more stuff to explore. So let's just have a look at that. Oh, what's the stuff over here? We haven't seen that yet. And Rebellion. isn't there also some stuff there? Ah, oh, yes. We need it all. We're collectors. Damn, she sounds exhausted. You good? Or maybe that was it? No, it's not. We can continue. It's really nicely made, how we just have to crawl some places, swim some places, jump over some stuff. Ooh, a measle statue. And that might be it. Okay, now we can take the exit. We need to go back into the other room. I hope Poppy's okay with this. I mean, uh, she's not really getting anything. It's just us collecting all the stuff, taking it up. We could have just shared. She's the one showing us this location after all, but we're just uh, looting everything. She's so kind to follow, and if we cast Luma, she will too. Okay, so I hope it's this way. I don't remember which way it would be, so... No, this is where we came from. We came from here, so we need to go the other way. That's where we saw the Froopers over there. So this way. Ah, yes. But we still need to find those, um, fireflies. That was one down there. I'm just wondering, do we have to go down to fetch it, or can we fetch it like this? Lumos. Can I take it over here? Can I grab it? No, I can't. Might need to go down for it. Is it frozen in the lake or something? I can't do my loomers down here. Oh, maybe I need to go like here? Oh, oh okay, there's a fine line between standing and swimming. I need I need it to move, I imagine. Yeah. Okay, that's the one. 
hope it will follow us here. Okay. Okay, it did. That's good. But we need another one, I imagine. Question is, where do we get this one? Hmm. So what happens if we just pull this? So what happened now? Oh, great, nothing. Um, so where do I get that other one? Maybe it was back. Um, oh, wait, something's happening there. Wait, what? When I spin this one, this one shows up. Maybe it wasn't meant to be that I should get that one first. Maybe I needed some other first. Hmm. Merlin, it's beautiful. Oh, we need three here. How? Oh wait, can we take them from the other places? That's surprising we could do this jump. That's quite a lot of distance. Um, can we steal this Lumos. one? Oh, we can steal it. Okay, and then I'm just doing such a great dive like that. Just listen to the music also here. This might take some time to get. Oh, okay. I think I have it. No, wait, what happened to this one now? Oh, okay, it flew into this. So what happens if we move this one? Oh, that's the bridge. Okay, so that might actually be better to have than rather than this one. Because this one was just to get the fly that we already put into it. So let's um let's put this one over here. That's one. But then we need three. How do we do that? Lumos. Like it makes sense here, right? Now we got two. Then the third one. If I remove it, then the bridge is gonna disappear. What if I'm fast though? Oh, okay. I don't have to be fast. It's just, uh... Rebellion. It's just stuck there. You did it. Good stuff. And let's do some good magic. There we go. Nice. Rebellion. Do we have here? That's pretty much it. Some tongues, of course. Are the water's bubbling? How about? Are the water's bubbling? Look. Maybe. Maybe let's have a look at the chest first. How do you feel about that puppy? And afterwards, we can go down to where the water is bubbling. I would be a bit cautious about going close to where water is bubbling. Like, why is it bubbling? Is it boiling? It might not be the best thing just to dive into. But we're here. And we want our hork lump juice, which is right over there. Alright, I can hold shift to swim faster. I need to do that. That's our crawl swimming here. I don't know what you call... Like, I think... I don't know what you call this movement, but I think that is called crawl, if I remember right. That My style of rebellion. swimming. Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. It's got to be. Wow. It's it. It was just like finding the phoenix. Okay, so what do we have? We'll probably remove that. I don't know. I've been listening to them for a while now, and I'm starting to lose my mind. Oh. <laughs> Very funny. I was just thinking how it's proof that poachers haven't been here, assuming this is where the moon is, which means we're one step ahead of them. Hopefully. Rebellion. No, like one step ahead of. Them. Oh, just be right back. I have an alarm. One second.
It's always good to have an alarm where it says, look for poachers. All right, let's uh, let's continue. We found it. Oh, hey, is that the moonstone? Like it is. Directly at the moon. Let's take this one. What about these fruiters? Shouldn't we take those? Or rescue them? Okay, but I guess they're not in danger. Maybe. Oh, but we need to talk to Poppy. So what? Wait, I just need to see what goes on down here. I'm just a bit curious. Ah, wait, so this is where we delivered those fireflies. Okay, so we've actually... I think we've uh, explored it all. Okay, but let's go up to Puppy then and talk to her. That's probably a good idea. How do we go up? get up again? Oh yeah, over here. Here we go. Well done, that wasn't too bad, actually. I thought we would meet the right after all. more enemies. A good thing, too. We need every advantage over the poachers if we're to get to the Snidgets first. We should do as Doran suggested and bring the Moonstone to the Henge. The Henge. Okay, let's leave. Shall we? We shall. If we leave now, we should make it there by nightfall. Oh, so the quest isn't complete. We might have more stuff to do. Well, that's okay. But it's, um... This was, I think, this was more of a... That's the Henge. This was a very chill quest. said it would be. But now that we're here, I'm not entirely sure how to feel. We knew we were at the cave for the Moonstone, but Doran didn't tell us what to expect when we placed the stone in the hen. Ah, right. Okay, this might be... Um... I doubt it's dangerous. I don't think Doran would knowingly send us into danger. You're right. I suppose I'm worrying over nothing. Let's make our way down. We're okay. nearly at the end of this. I think that's it over there. How's your gran doing, by the way? Nothing keeps gran down. She set up a catawalling charm and threatened to make a coat out of the next poacher that set foot on her doorstep. Hmm. I still feel terrible that I'm the reason they went there. Surely she'll be pleased you've gone after the Snidgets. I hope so. Gran understands how important it is to protect those who need it. Right. Okay, so that's where we need to place the stone. I think we can safely say we know where the moonstone goes. Yeah, let's put it here. Fancy stuff. Oh. <laughs> These eyes. So we're growing mushrooms now? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wherever they're running. They're like spawning a trail of mushrooms. Are they drawing something? Whoa. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was a moon calf dance. Do you know how rare it is to see even one? They only ever happen have no on idea. the full moon. Though I suppose the moonstone allowed it to happen now. Is the pattern they left behind on the ground normal? Why is our All cloak that windy? Dance. No one pattern is ever the same, though. We'll need to draw this one to get a better sense of it. Can't wait to tell Gran that I've managed to see not one, but two Moongarf dances. She'll be jealous. You've seen this before? It was pure luck the first time. I was on high wing, or I'd never have spotted it. It was the night I... Well, the night I met high wing, actually, I... Hmm. I'd love to hear about it. We can't just stop there. Let's I'd hear, about, hear about how you and Highwing met. I'd actually like you to know. Okay. About five years ago, Highwing had been captured by poachers. At first, they planned to sell her, but soon decided they wanted to kill her instead. More money, I suppose. I'd finally had enough. I freed Highwing and we ran. We'd flown for ages when I spotted Mooncalves dancing below and we landed to watch them. It felt like an omen. A good one. A sign that the worst was over. What do you mean you'd had enough and the worst was over? You see, the night I freed Highwing was also the night I ran away from home. A poacher camp. I come from a family of poachers. Oh, snap. That's awful. Berlin. I don't know what to say, Poppy. 
I can't imagine what that must have been like for you. I never fitted in. But the older I got, the more apparent it became. Gran tried for years to convince my parents to let me live with her. Suffice it to say, when I left with High Wing, I flew straight for her house. How brave. I'm glad you escaped. So am I. There were so many creatures I was unable to help when I was younger. Now that's all I want to do. Well, I mean, you're succeeding. From everything I've seen, you're doing precisely that. <laughs> yeah, right. I've had a bit of help. I've never told anyone any of this, but I'm glad that you know. It's nice to have someone to talk about it with. It's just... I'm not gonna ask too much. That's okay. I'm glad you told me. We should get back to Doran. He'll need to see the symbol. And we've got poachers to beat. Exactly. That's if the spirit. If you collect the moonstone, I can make a quick drawing of the symbol for Doran. Okay. Got the moonstone. Oh, that was it. Are you finished with the drawing? Just... Barely. <laughs> okay. I think... You're fast at drawing them. Bird. At least that's what it looks like. Didn't the journal say is it the a key to find the snidget lies in the moonlight? Of course. That's it. We need to show this to Doran. Not that I'd know where to find him at this hour. Perhaps we should head back to the castle and we can track him down after a good night's sleep. It sounds like a good idea. Agreed. I'm ready to leave if you are. Okay, I actually thought this one would uh, be much more fighting because usually every time when we talk to uh, when we talk to Puppy and we go on her missions, it's like dragons, poachers, all the crazy stuff is happening with the most seemingly innocent person. Okay, the centaur and the stone completed. Nice. So we didn't we didn't exactly go to bed. We just stayed outside. So what do we have? We got this one in the map chamber and then we have ominous in the catacomb where we can learn avada kedavra okay let's maybe find our focus speak with natty in the great hall and just teleport here We've got a lot of quests going on. We barely have any time, or well, we don't have any time to study ever. What are you up to now? That's not a part of going to school, right? It's just going from place to place and uh, talking to people, doing side stuff. Some days are more difficult than others. Okay. Is today a difficult one? Natty, is everything all right? <sighs> There are times when my father's absence drifts to the back of my mind. And I feel peace for a day or two. But this is not one of those times. Mm. I miss him. I miss running with him. I miss Matty Belliland. He should still be here. And it's my fault that he isn't. Hmm. I don't want to argue with her, I'm just going to say I'm sorry. sorry, Natty. I wish there was something I could do to help. You have done plenty. In fact, many of my good days are good because of you. The That's bad something. days, however, I believe I would feel less helpless if I could truly put an end to Harlow and the rest of Rookwood's miserable lot. Oh damn, Each thirsty for, re free, for revenge, huh? Damage, leaving people like Archie Bickle to suffer the consequences. I agree, Natty. We'll get them. So we're going for I've revenge. Never seen someone so committed to a cause. Thank you. I believe we will get them. Beginning with Harlow. Okay, Thank so we're going on an assassination mission. Helpful. Well, that was it. Revelio. All we did was listen mostly, but I guess that's also how you can have a conversation going. Um. Okay, that's it. Then let's go to ominous quests and ominous. Let's locate him on map. He might be down in that... Oh, he's over here. 
So I guess this is one of the few times where we're actually approaching Ominous just by ourselves and it has nothing to do with Sebastian. But then at the other hand, they're not really on the best terms either. Sebastian is a bit crazy for saving his sister, which makes sense, Mysterious of course, but he's also... Unsettling. He wants to, to do, do it at any cost. Oh, wait. Sebastian has gone too far. You saw what lies in the catacomb. I cannot stay here. Did he go in? Wait, Anne, please. Ominous. He was willing to put the whole hamlet and himself in danger on the chance that some old relic could help to heal me. I'm sorry, Ominous. Make sure he's all right, will you? I'm glad okay. you're here. How's she doing? I guess she's okay. Could actually be interesting just to follow, just to see where do they actually go. Like when NPCs are going, where they're walking. But it's going to take some time, I imagine. Okay, that's where they go. Mystery solved. Case closed. Okay, so that doesn't look too good. I received your owl. Where's Sebastian? Inside the catacomb. Frankly, I was surprised you weren't with him. Ominous. I... Stop. You swore you wouldn't let Sebastian take this one step further. We can't control him. Yet here we are. Why is he so angry at us? Um. Should we just take it on us? We can take it on us. That's okay. It's my fault. I was wrong. I thought he'd stop. I should have stopped him before. Sebastian's in real trouble now. I'm going back into the catacomb to find him. Anne's right. He and the entire hamlet are in danger. But you're... The place is crawling with Inferi. Inferi? What Damn. are you talking about? You'll see. We need to hurry. Well, we know Inferi. We've met those before, but... Sebastian must not be in his right mind. Probably going to help a little bit to have, like, some vision as well, because he's, he's completely blind, no? I know he can talk the snake talk and all, but it might be good to be two Last in here. Last time we were here, this place was crawling with spiders. We're about oh. to face worse. Let's find Sebastian quickly. Okay. Akio. Rebellion. Mm. So just a box, that was all. Okay. Let's continue. Why was Sebastian when you and Am found him? Just ahead. In the great room. Oh, that's the inferior. Defender. Glacius. Defender. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Bombarder. Crucial. No, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh yeah, right. He doesn't like it. He doesn't like when I'm casting these spells. Interrupt an inferior's overhead slam with Bombarder. Oh. I need another bombarder. Ouch. Was that it? No, that wasn't it. Okay, never mind. I'm not gonna do those uh, things. Let's just get rid of these guys. Nothing. And nothing. Okay. So which way do you want to go? We can go this way. Do we have more enemies? Ah, spiders. Nice. Defeat the Inferi, that's what we need to do. I guess we got all the chests because we've been here before. So we should just defeat, I guess. Hmm. Some skull we can't collect. Oh, that's okay. 
probably gonna find more skulls, I imagine. There weren't this many in theory before. And there's no sign of Sebastian. Oh damn, we can explode them. Okay, let's go down and say hi to them. Okay, so we shouldn't use our curses, then he's gonna be angry on this. Sebastian, I didn't even realize. Anne's gone to get Solomon. When she first saw the Inferi, she thought Sebastian was being attacked. But then he showed her the relic and said he'd learned how to use it. The carvings on the relic were Inferi, and Sebastian somehow created them. Not exactly. He's controlling them. This is powerful dark magic. Creating Inferi is incredibly difficult, but controlling them. As Anne and I frantically barricaded the Inferi to keep them from escaping, Sebastian kept mumbling about healing Anne. When Anne said she couldn't stay here, I didn't realize what she meant. So oh. threatened to go to the headmaster if he heard of Sebastian dealing with dark magic. I need to get Hogwarts. He's gonna get thrown I must out. get to Professor Black first. Twist the story a bit, make him think it's a family fight. I'll be back as soon as I can. See if you can talk some sense into Sebastian. Oh, but he's down here then? Be careful. Rebellion. Okay, well, uh, you too. Accio. Look at all these heads. So much, uh... So many dead skulls. Um, I guess we shouldn't explore too much since we've already been in here. So maybe this is just the way. Is it Sebastian we have down here? <laughs> Mm. So which way is the right way? Is it this way? The Inferi. They're everywhere. Must be this place. Now I can cast my curses there. Right, I need to hit them with fire first. Okay, so I've got to fire them up. Here we go. Oh, this is the one spawning them, probably. Okay, look at all these skulls. This is crazy. Luckily, they're not uh, they're not as fast as the goblins. They can just teleport and swiftly attack you, but these can't, which is a good thing. But this wasn't even the right place. 
it's actually uh there was some chests there Rebellion. so not all for nothing but but still wigan wells too we have all 25 so we can't get more i'm wondering if we didn't take the chest here last time we were here this looks like quite an obvious place i would imagine that i would have taken those okay so that wasn't the right place what about in here Alright, I need to attack it with a fire spell. There we go. Hmm. Okay, so three ways we can go. Maybe this way? These inferi seem far. Oh snap. Expelliarmus. Couldn't bring them. Expelliarmus. Incendio. Glacius. Accio. Let me answer. Descendo. Incendio. Expelliarmus. Couldn't bring them. Arresto momentum. Well, maybe it's this way? Oh, this is probably just some secret Rebellion. chamber. And look, we've got the chest already. Or oh, maybe we don't. We don't have the chest. Oh, wait, we do. It's already opened. Okay. Um, so I guess we need to go back. Yeah, this is probably it. Anything in here? Probably not. Oh, there is a chest, but it's probably open. Yeah, it's opened already. And we can't carry any more wing welds, so let's just proceed. Okay, so it's either left or right. Let's try to go right. Hope this is the way. Oh, wait, now we're back to where we started. This was where Ominous left us. Okay, that's not the right way. But haven't we gone all the ways then? This is where we started, no? Or not where we started, but the first place we went. Now there's just more. Ouch. Oh, it doesn't even attack him. That should probably do it. Okay, so he's not in here. That's for certain. And there's no way to go. Oh wait, maybe there are some places we can go here. No, there's not. I think we've unlocked all the... Or we did open all the doors here. So we can go this way? Oh yeah, we haven't been here, I think. I hope. Aha, look at that, Sebastian. Now we gotta talk to him again. Gotta talk some sense into him again. This is a bit of a game. I think we already did that, but... Okay. Um, what do we need to use? There we go. Let's build some staircase. That's good enough for me. Or it's not. Wait, do we need to build the whole thing? Okay, fair enough. Uh, how do I put it over there? Oh. Probably like that. Wow. Just wrap yourself around this stuff. Do I really have to make that thing? I have to do it. <laughs> it's interesting how how far how like how tall we can jump and how far we can jump sometimes. But then when we go places like this, it's like nope, can't do. 
Oh, come on. Just go. They know what I'm trying to do. How much precision do we need for this? <laughs> Is this good enough for you? Are you okay with this, maybe? <laughs> do we have to build that thing? We do. Why doesn't sometimes, like, that's a bit annoying that it just sometimes just doesn't fall into place. So what if we put it here? So how much time do we have to just spend on trying to place this? This is getting a little dull already. <laughs> Just put yourself in, fall into place, come on, snap a little better. So it's because we need to get all the bones up. Come here, all bones, yes. Oh, we still have one or two. Come on, everyone's up. Oh, come on. This is the dumbest thing. Like this is this this just feels like you're uh, I don't know. What about now? What if we do a depulsa one of them? Okay, so that makes sense. So we just have to place it over here and then it falls into place, but if we place it right next to it, then it doesn't. There's Sebastian. What did he create there? Is that his sister? Oh. Oh, he's controlling is them. Incredible. How is that helping your sister? You've created like three siblings or what? Sebastian, I told you. The relic is the answer. I've been trying to reverse the dark magic that injured Anne, but this will allow me to control it. Just as I can control the Inferi. Control? I had to fight the Inferi all the way. <laughs> what Solomon. Two of you done? Akio Relic. Solomon, don't. The Relic. You'll pay for this. But. <laughs> Damn. Family fight. So do we have to fight him now? We have to follow him. Why do we do that? Why are we fighting his family? Okay, well, I mean, whatever they... I mean, fair enough, he's never really been that nice, so... But let's just get rid of these first. Can you chill for a bit? Can you become an object maybe? Oh, that didn't work. Oh wait, keep him there. Okay, whatever, let's just get rid of this guy. Ouch. Yeah, what happened to that? Oh, he's not. Okay. Okay, this is a bit annoying. 
Okay, it's time to get rid of this boy. Here we go with some of our good magic. Guess it's that time of the day, huh? Oh, we have? <laughs> Unfortunately, we need to uh, get rid of you. Okay, time to deal some damage to Solomon. <laughs> yeah, that's what he deserves. We don't want to kill him though. But okay, we had to get rid of this fight. I think the Infernos would just keep on respawning, so... Don't kill him. Okay, Sebastian. You killed your uncle. Incendio! Oh, damn. Hands back. He killed his own uncle. That's what needed to talk sense into Sebastian. He needed to kill his own uncle. No! You've made your choice. Damn. Yeah, me? <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry about that. Okay, Sebastian, you're on your own now. I must get out of here. What have I done? I can't let him leave. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Sebastian, wait! Oh, okay. I can't grab him. Just have to follow him. Fair enough. Stop, Sebastian. Hold on. Where does he want to go? So I guess at the end of the day, we were really on the wrong side because we wanted to help Anne, but killed his uncle or killed Sebastian's and Anne's uncle. It's not exactly the best outcome. Where does he want to go also? Why does he say, like, look what we've done? <laughs> that was the most surprising part. He killed the person and he's like, look what we've done. Now he's normal again, okay. Why wouldn't you stop? 
I was calling after you. Anne won't survive this. She's withering away, inside and out. Solomon's never been there for us. Dude, you really. just killed him. He gave up on Anne. I'll never give up on her. You saw him, didn't you? He was going to ruin her life. He attacked us. I... I had to use the killing curse. You know I did. Oh, come I on, don't justify it, yourself. Um... This puts me in a dilemma, because if I say no one should know that curse, then we might not learn it. Maybe we should learn it. Everyone should know that curse. Okay, he we're just going to pass. You had no choice. It was brave, Sebastian. You clearly care more about Anne than your uncle ever did. I don't think so. Understand. I did do the right thing. You <laughs> no, did. you didn't. <laughs> I would have done the same. No, we wouldn't. If I knew how. I could teach you. Yes, please. No time like the present. The killing curse won't be easy to master. As with all unforgivables, you have to mean it. Because we Would need to learn steady? it, right? Focus. The incantation is Avada Kedavra. Your intention must be clear. Okay. Got you. I can't stay here. I need to find Ominous. Sebastian. Please, I'm not myself right now. Let's meet later at the Undercroft, all right? Sounds like a plan. In the shadow of the relic. Let's try it out, though. Hmm, so... What should we change it with, though? Maybe this? Okay, let's try it. So it actually just kills in one shot. What's the cooldown on it? Probably has a large one. But we would never have done the same that he did. I thought that was pretty dumb what he just did there. Why did he have to kill him? Okay, I mean, they wrote the story, not me. Oh, I mean, we had to fight him. Pleasant surprise. Um, so if we use the Mallow Suite, what are we going to do here? Let's try it. We gotta solve some of these. Oh, but I just don't know what we need to do with these things. Do we need to touch them or something? Climb them? No, that's not it. Oh, Confringo. Okay, we can do that. Hmm. Where else would we have them? Probably around here. Ah, yes. Confringo! Anything down here? Oh yes, there is. Incendium. Look at that. Hmm, so there must be more. Revelio. One over here? Ah yep. This is probably it. Confringo! Not so tricky after nice. All, oh, just one out of ten. <laughs> We've really ne been neglecting these, but that's because they require that mellow suite that we just never really had. But now we've got it though. So now we can finally start completing these. Okay, that's nice. Let's get the balloons as well. There were some balloons over here, I think. Oh, yes. Oh, they're just in a circle. Or in a star, I guess, since it's five. Nice. So that's four out of fifteen. 
Is there a try against these? The poachers? Oh no, that's Scotland's. Holy smokes. Dangerous spell, huh? Oh. They're fighting against us, okay. You had a little sock that. One less poacher in the wizarding world. All right. Um. Let's see our quest log. Now we got the lovely spell that uh, Sebastian he threw an excellent example of why we shouldn't use that. But now we need to go to the map chamber again. Okay, we can do that. We actually know how to get to this one. Hopefully. Maybe before we do that, let's just sell some stuff. So let's go to Hogsmeade and just our regular. I don't like I should know his name by now and he should know our name by now because we've been that so many times. But for now, I'll try to remember it. Is it Jay Pippins? 10 points to Gryffindor if it's uh, Jay Pippins it or not Gryffindor, Ravenclaw, Ravenclaw in this case. Let's see. Please be Jay Pippins. Please be Jay Pippins. Come on in. Oh, it's Perry Pippin, so it's Should P Pippin. Okay, but it was close. But no points to Gryffindor or Ravencrest in that, in that uh, case. Oh, we can wear these glasses now. That's pretty nice. I hope to see you again. These were amazing, these glasses. Um... Was it face wear? Exactly. Oh, we look beautiful again. Um, we can change the appearance of those, of course. We just go with this. Oh wait, our normal glasses, right. Um, I don't know if we have anything that's much better here. We could also just go to our room of requirement first. If we go to Hogwarts map and then the secret rooms and room of requirement just to uh, identify these items. Because we have so much unidentified now in our bag, and if it's not if it's not better than what we have, then we might as well just sell it. So identify gear. Oh, look at that! We got quite some upgrades. Even a dark sun hat. Let's try to equip it if we can. That is, uh, headwear. Ninety five. That's pretty fancy, isn't that the one our herbology teacher has? Um, what else do we have? This one ninety nine. Cool. And an outfit item. Ooh, fancy stuff. And I guess we could sell the rest so we could go back again to... Uh, okay, we're doing a bit of traveling back and forth, but that's just to get rid of all these items. So back to Harry Pippin. Was it Perry? It's P. Pippins for sure. I guess we'll see. Okay. Please be Perry. Please be a Perry. We have everything a young student oh, it is Perry. It's interesting, I haven't seen like Perry with an A. So P A double R Y. Thirty one K gold right now. I guess we should uh we should probably uh we should probably sell those uh, or buy those brooms because now we can't just afford it. it seems like we can afford anything more or less the unique unicorn hmm that also sounds pretty interesting now well, let's go with the main quest let's go with this one send barax trial it's time to do another trial yeah and we know where it is it's in awkwards and in secret rooms and in map the map chamber and this was the one that really screwed me over because if you track that or at least when i was tracking it it just sort of led you out of hogwarts and down below like the water and that's i think that's also the case where we actually fell below the map because we just went back and forth all the time 
Okay, but um, let's begin the quest. I hope Professor Fig got my owl. I need to tell him and the keepers that Ranrock knows where the last repository is. According to the owl I received, Ranrock is moving more quickly than we could have anticipated. He's always this is more quickly. Great news, and indeed. it's always it's always bad news. More time to discuss the best path forward. Let us hear what the student has to say. Yes. How about that? You received my owl. And did you see your new Ranrock hat? Ranrock has the last of Bragbor's journals. He killed Loggok to get it. He knows where the last repository is. Godric's heart. Loggok. Loggok and Ranrock were brothers. Loggok was bringing the journal to me. Ranrock is a monster. We need to know where the final repository is. True. But isn't that in the book? Surely this changes things. Ranrock has Bragbor's journals and knows where the final repository is. We obliviated Bragbor. He kept journals? Why would he have documented all of this? He didn't know what we were containing. Oh. Um. Did Isidore tell him? I don't know if that's true or not. If we say I cannot say, that's also like holding back information. Let's just be honest. Isadora told Bragbor about the magic when she asked him to build a container for her. I've seen her memories. Isadora left memories for someone to find? You know what she did? Her memories showed what she did for her father, which I also saw in Professor Rookwood's pensive. And a conversation with Bragbor in which she expressed frustration about the limits being placed on her use of ancient magic. Based upon the memories they have seen, I believe our young friend is well aware of the grave circumstances in which we find ourselves. Yeah. The next trial will involve an exceptional level of magical skill and a nuanced ability to interact with beasts. <laughs> okay. Do we have that ability? Do we possess Find that? Find a face of stone and tendrils. A face of stone and tendrils. I should advise you that you must engage with any beast that is part of the trial on your own. Okay. Professor Bakar will meet you in his pensive room. Okay. An exceptional level of magical skill? Nuanced ability to interact with beasts? Hmm. Hmm. I suppose we should begin our search for a face of stone and tendrils. Whatever that may be. Very well. Professor Weasley has been keeping an eye on me. Perhaps we should meet there, so she has no reason to raise concerns with Professor Black. Okay. I shall see you near the coast. Perhaps then you can tell me a little more about the memories of Isadora that you witnessed. Yeah, so where do we need to go? Meet Professor Fig at San Bacar's pensive chamber. Wherever that is. Oh, that's far away, for sure. We need to head south. Oh, it's all the way down here. Okay, and I don't have the flu flame for it. We can go over here. Oh, we have a bunch of uh, side missions as well to get. We should also go for those. But I think for now, let's just stick. Let's just stick to the main mission here, and completing his uh, Bakar's trial. What are you up to now? I'm up to Bakar's trial. In case you didn't get to hear me. Um. And maybe we can also just get rid of our hat. Not rid of it, but uh, just uh, hide it. Here we go. Alright. So, 500 meters. Alright, we still have that lunchbox below us. Well, you can't actually see it for the cape. That's a good way to hide our lunch. Nobody can steal our lunch. They won't be able to see it when we have this, uh, when we're wearing this uh, cloak thingy coat. Hmm. So somewhere here? Ah, oh, right. We need to go in here. Okay. Okay. Cannot enter while mounted. Fair enough. But we can get a flu flame here. That's quite nice. Damn, you're fast, Fix. <laughs> I have good news. Mm -hmm. We do not have Rebellion. any of Ranrock's loyalists to contend with. Good for you. The bad news is that it's likely be 
because they no longer need to track the keepers for information. Is that a? It is. Oh. I believe I know what. That's the tendrils, huh? Okay. Do you recognize the head sculpted there? Hmm. Is it uh? Davy Jones? I'm not That's certain. That's a head. I can't say that I do. It appears to be a fearsome beast known as a grap horn. Okay, I would and have never guessed that. The into the ground <laughs> lead me to believe that a grap horn will somehow open the way forward. A That's what horn. Professor Rackham meant when he spoke of my needing an ability to interact with beasts. It would seem so. I do know that the last of a long dynasty of grap horns lives nearby. They call him the Lord of the Shore. Lord of the Shore. I suspect you'll need <laughs> to bring him here. Okay. What happens next? I can't say. Okay, I guess we need to um If that's what must be done. Let's get do Lord it. of the Shore Excellent. to away from I the shore. I know this area well enough. When you see the remains of a large sea creature, you're in the right place. Okay. Now, Professor Rackham made it clear that you must engage with any beast that is part of this trial on your own. So, I shall wish you good luck and wait for your return in the map chamber. Yeah, fair enough. Thank you for the good luck. All right, we can't uh, use the broom here. We need to go out. Can we use it here? No, we can't. Okay, so we need to actually just leave this area. Oh, wait, it's 1,200 meters away. Maybe we could actually just uh, take a flu flame. Oh, yes. Let's just take it over here. The easy way. I guess that's the perks of just having explored uh, some of the map in advance. It's good to have. It's uh, quite convenient. Oh, nice to see you, my young friend. And another Merlin trial. We could get that. What do you have in store for me this time? Oh wait, maybe we just Confido. after uh, dealing with this thing. Can it kill that? It actually kills one of these, even though that they're so tanky. Not enough mellow sweet. Okay, never mind. We can't use it. <laughs> well, let's get the tongue at least. Then we got something at least. Okay. 100 meters. That's not too bad. This place has seen better days. And what's in here? Some enemies. Oh, snap. Alright, she's also using it. Hit a ranger with stupefy. <laughs> oh, she's just constantly Livioso. I should hit it with stupefy. Can I do that? Can I hit you with stupefy? They do all the ones that I can't just uh, stupefy. That's all they do? Come on. Oh, come on. Okay, never mind. Where did the want go? Yeah, they don't really do anything I can just do stupefy with. Oh, she'll die from the flames, I think. Oh. Maybe from that. Okay. It's shameful what you've done to helpless beasts. And here we are. So this is it? This must be the place. Ooh. Raffhorn's den, Lord of the Shore. Here we go. Quite a large den. Very well, Lord of the Shore. Show yourself. Uh oh. Maybe we need to uh, earn his respect first. Damn. What kind of dog is this? Do we need to fight it? Ouch. Okay, I need to change my tactics here. He's fast. Oh, you really got to dodge quickly here. This guy. Okay, I'm not I haven't dodged any of his strikes so far. 
still can't. Okay. Okay, that one I got, finally. Just gotta get used to this guy. Look at that, look at those strikes though. Need to get rid of this guy quickly. He's fast for such a big animal. Okay, he's just kicking my ass. Only because I have all these wing wells that we're surviving here. Guess we can't talk about it. But I can't use any curses on him either. That's not allowed apparently. Okay, can we talk about it? Is this the right time? We don't want to fight you. Uh oh, what is this now? It's glowing. Ouch. Ouch. Okay, I guess it's just time to try whatever we can. At least I dodged that one. But I'm not dodging any of this. <laughs> Ouch. Oh, I just wanted to use my incendio on it. Okay. We're just going the tanky way. That's all we can do pretty much. I can't dodge any of these. <laughs> I got one there. Okay, that's the tail we're getting. Long live 25 wing welds, huh? Yeah. So what do we need to do then? We shouldn't kill it, right? God, it's so fast. Ouch. Ouch. Just wing wells all the way. I have no idea how to stop this thing. Ugh, that tail attack again. I'm not used to these mechanics at all. <laughs> okay, just wing welled up. Okay, let's just kill this thing. You're going down now. Yeah, sorry to say Lord of the Shore, but it's uh, it's time to tame you. Neil? Peace. <laughs> okay, we're gonna get wrecked. Oh. Friend? I feel like we're in Avatar right now. All we need now is like, uh... Wait, what? That's a pretty large mount. Grapplehound has a powerful charge attack that deals large amount of damage up to enemies and certain barricades hold uh, left click to initiate keep an eye for grapple on stamina meter as charging will drain it okay damn we just tamed lord of the shore what say we pick up the pace a bit oh snap okay holy shit <laughs> Okay. So that w that's what we got now. This is a bumpy ride for sure. Poachers. Let's see how the Lord of the Shore feels about his neighborhood being <laughs> Okay. 
that's one way to uh, go about it. <laughs> Guess let's just follow the the trail. Just listen to the music also. Ooh. It'll take more than this to stop you. Alright, we also have a health bar, so we should just uh but it's definitely tanky. I'm wondering, I'm wondering if we're going to keep this after this. Beep beep. It's a pretty cool quest. We have to give him that. This is quite nice. I didn't expect us to mount anything like this in the game, so I'm quite surprised about that. It's pretty cool. Alright, 200 meters. This is just the music. So epic, right? That's a really cool quest. How do you use it to unlock the... Oh, wait. That's it? Power of Wigan World Potions. Because I didn't I didn't dodge one single attack by that thing. It was way too quick for me. <laughs> oh, fancy. I guess we can't uh, have Lord of the Shore coming with us in that. He's too large for it. Or she is. I think it was a she, actually. Oh, can we go in? Oh, okay. You can't enter while mounted. So how do I dismount? Oh, doesn't mean I have this part. Like, oh yeah, I have it now. Ah, there you are. Oh, okay, there you are. Like you needed to look for it in your massive bag. Okay, let's go in and see. Witness the pensive memory. Oh, so maybe that was the trial. So let's get some more truth on what happened. We still didn't see Isadora's part of the story. I kind of also want to see that. Perhaps Professor Rakham was right to have had faith in you. I still have my reservations. Isadora, as you will see, was not who she seemed. I can only hope that you are. Well, hopefully. My memories should answer any questions you may have about the power you will need to protect. Okay. Thank you, Professor Bakar. I shall see you back in the map chamber. So... You need to learn something in order to protect it. And never use it. You just need to learn it. And then you can't tell anyone about it. Rebellion. And you should just protect it. Isn't it more protected if nobody knows about it? Is there anything else we need to, to do here? Gotta love these halls. Just look how big they are. And also the detail just in the in the ceiling. Do we see where we are? Okay, probably in some den, I imagine. Yeah, I guess so. Okay, let's have a look at the memory. I guess Fig isn't here with us anymore. 
So now it's just us on our own. All right, let's see Bakar's version of the story. Hello? Isadora. Isadora. Oh, the father. Uh-oh. Something is up. Son, I'm glad you're here. Isadora was not at her home. I know. Her father. First of all... What is it? It is as though he was stripped not only of his pain, but of all emotion. Everything is much worse than I feared. Neve was right. Isadora hasn't stopped. I've just learned that she has been wielding that magic on students. Uh oh. We must gather the others. Okay, so it takes away the pain momentarily before it takes away everything. Like his uh, subtle hand behind the back while he's uh, <laughs> while he's uh, looking like he's going to attack with that move. What have you done? Take a breath. Students, Isadora. Everyone feels pain. Why? Because of your arrogance? Your obsession with secrets? He won't suffer any longer. Not my father. Not my students. No one. Well, what's the point Isadora. of not suffering if you can't feel anything? Set and you can't feel happiness wand. either. Professor, it's just like your dad or not born yet. My power. Not... Throw it away! I did not teach you this. Expelliarmus! Uh oh. Couldn't he just cast a separate beam on, beam on her? Did they have to do it like that? Damn, so Bakar killed her. real question is, is she actually dead? Oh, she might be. Use the magical password. Passageway. So that's why she's not there in the frame as well? But the others are dead too, I imagine. Okay, so that's what happened. Speak with the keepers. Well, now we know what happened at least. Oh, I need to go up here to talk to them. <laughs> the caverns below Hogwarts, where you fought Isadora. Is that the location of the final repository? It is. You see... We could not destroy the strands of emotion Isadora had stolen from so many. 
So we did all that we could to keep them safe. We also realized that until they could be destroyed, the magic used to create them was a danger to wizard kind. Hence, we became keepers. Keepers of an unfathomable secret. We knew that someday, one with the ability to see traces of ancient magic might be seduced by its power. We built the trials to lead that person to us, to allow them to prove themselves worthy of the knowledge we'd kept hidden and the responsibility that accompanies it. Have I not proven myself, Professor? I need to get to that repository before Rand What do we need to do you with have, it? You have, and you will. But the repository is protected by powerful ancient magic. To enter, you must craft a special wand oh. from the four artifacts you found above our pensives. So the repository is safe from Ranrock for now. If he is, as you suspect, capable of using the power of the other repository, I fear he will be able to breach our defenses. Then I must go now and craft this wand. Perhaps Mr. Ollivander will help me. Another Ollivander? I'm not surprised. As I am sure he will tell you, this wand may be used for only one purpose. Return with the wand, and we will open the way forward. Okay. I shall send an owl ahead to Ollivander. Whilst you visit him, I'll reach out to Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley? Yes. I may have made an error in judgment by not informing her of Ranrock's intentions earlier. Mm. I only hope it's not too late. Well, let's hope if so. If Ranrock really is going to try to drill below Hogwarts, we'll need all the help we can get. All right, Professor. I'll see you soon. All right. I can talk to Rackham. Can I also talk to the others? No, I can't. What can I talk to him about? What am I to do with the artifacts, Professor Rackham? Take them to Mr. Ollivander. Right. He will help you to <laughs> Okay, fair enough. That can be used to I thought we could ask him about his uh, hat or something interesting. His beard or... Oh. So now it's tracked. Okay. Well, Ollivander, he's down at the Hawksmeade, no? Map. Oh, yes. Let's go to Hawksmeade. He is right here. So let's craft that wand. So we're ready. Ready to fight the bat. Or, I don't know, dispel that curse or get to that... I still don't know what we need to do with the chamber Sometimes or that artifact to thing. To Ancient speed. magic stuff. I guess we'll find out. I hope he can help me craft oh, we need to wait wand. for him. Meet me in the Forbidden Forest. Oh, so we just slept out here. Oh, right here. Begin. Want mastery. Maybe this actually might be a good uh, place to stop for now. We can stop here with the want mastery. So I'll just I'll save right here, and then uh, in the next part we will talk to Ollivander and craft our wand. I think this might be it for now, guys. But yeah, thank you for watching, and I hope that you have a nice day. Cheers.